So, ladies and gentlemen, I this is Kurt Sassick, president of Wine Tasters Choice. I am very proud to announce that I have with me today Mr. Alexander Biba. He is the CEO and owner of Viticcio Winery in Tuscany, Italy. And we have Mr. Danielle Inocette. He is the winemaker. So uh, I introduce you to them. And gentlemen, I thank you for your time. Could you please just briefly uh, introduce yourself for everybody? Alexander, this is Danielle. My family is owning Viticcio since 2014. We actually didn't have any uh, wine story before that. Uh, it was our it was our dream, big dream of me and my father, uh, to to have a winery and to produce uh, great wines in Tuscany because we were for many many years in love with Tuscany, with its culture, with its nature. I'm Daniel Innocenti, the winemaker and the, the agronomist of Viticcio. I was born in Greve, next to Viticcio, and my mother born, was born in the Viticcio house. So oh. I know very, very well this uh, area. This is uh, my, uh, my terroir, my, my house. Yes. I, I love this, this place. The wine, the vineyards are my life, I, uh, my dream of the life. So I study early viticulture in Florence, and then uh, I started to work uh, before another company, and then arrived here when I consider Viticcio my home. In 2014, we have also accomplished Viticcio which is in Greve with another cellar and another estate in Maremma. Uh, and it was all in 2014. So in 2014, uh, Viticcio became uh, twice bigger by the amount of vineyards. Uh, so we have um, 60 hectares of uh, the soil in uh, Greve in Chianti. And we have also the same amount 60 hectares of uh, land in uh, Maremma, in Maliano, in Toscana, uh, which is more. From each, from 60 hectares there and here, we have 30 hectares uh, of vineyards. The main, 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 main uh, varieties that we cultivate is, of course, uh, Sangiovese, because uh, in Chianti and in Chianti Classico, Sangiovese is the most important grape as well as uh, per Maremma, uh, where we produce Morellino di Scansano, which also must be at least 80% Sangiovese. Maremma is a very dry area, respect to Greve. Greve, it's a continental climate. Clima. Uh, when you have uh, normally win uh, winter very cold and summer very hot. In Maremma, you have uh, uh, Another situation, this, you, we have the sea next to the vineyards. So it's Medi with, Mediterranean climate. Mediterranean climate. The soil are different. Without going into too much detail, that, bring, that makes me think of another question. The climate near the Mediterranean is different. So if, if you're planting Sangiovese at Viticcio, and Sangiovese closer to the Mediterranean, how does that affect uh, the wine, the, the, the flavor? Proximity of Maremma's vineyards to the sea uh, and the uh, um, mistral winds that hit down from France and uh, hit the coast of Tuscany, they, uh, they, they give the grapes a lot of sapidity. Uh, uh, so in... Um, and in Maremma, the climate is more hot than in Greve, so you have usually more more sugars. Um, you have more ripe. Uh, the, the grape become more ripe, so the wine are more similar to Californian wines, uh, sweet, which less acidity, more easy to drink. That can uh, can age. Uh, Eight to ten years uh, without problem. The Sangiovese for Morellino can age at ten, uh, eight to ten years. In Greve, uh, it is necessary some year for have a good expression of uh, the flower 
and the body of the Sangiovese. Five years uh, uh, of aging in the bottles because uh, uh, the soil and the climate is different. You have a uh, uh, wine which more body, uh, tannin are more uh, strong. The acidity is, is higher with respect to Marema, so the wine become better after five years of aging the bottle. You consider that we, we make a longer aging in uh, barrel oak on uh, big Slavonian oak uh, barrel. Two different ways to age in the wine. In both area, we don't want in the plant the quantity, but the quality. So small quantity of grape, not too much branch from uh, of uh, of grape for plants. Only ten, uh, eight, uh, eight uh, branch for grapes for plants but if i'm not mistaken in viticcio you guys deliberately want less grapes on the vine so you have better quality grapes correct 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 and and better wine yeah and, we, uh, all, almost every year uh, we do the green harvesting uh, so in the end of july beginning of august we cut uh, up to 50 percent of uh, oh. green green uh, branches of uh, grapes to get the other half the double concentration of elements. What, what, and, and, and what, is, what is green harvesting? I'm not familiar with that term. So we, we cut them all in, in May uh, before uh, before the harvest. So when they're green and uh, green and small. Oh, before they turn into grapes, you cut. Right. They they're, so, they have small small grapes, uh, but they're they're totally green. Yeah. And the, then we pass in two times for the harvest. Okay. Yeah, for each vineyards oh. when we we are when we are harvesting all of our harvesting we do manually, so all of our wines are handcrafted and we do it on purpose. We can uh, we can have machines, but we don't want we want to remain traditional and we want to have more more uh, control on uh, the quality. So, but when you touch it, when you see it, uh, it's. It's always uh, it's always better. So yeah, when when we are when we are harvesting, we uh, for each vineyards we pass two times. So it means one time, first time we pass to collect uh, the you know, the um, the fifty percent of yeah, the grape. the fifty percent of the grape, and then after one week or two, we pass two another weeks. time. Yeah, after two weeks, we pass another time to. Uh, to collect the best remaining bunches. I, I noticed uh, that Viticcio is a state owned. In America, uh, if something is a state owned, a, a lot typically it means that everything is done at the winery. The growing the grape, picking the grape, making the wine, fermenting the wine, everything. So this way you have more control over the quality. So um does a state owned it means the same thing in italy is that correct we don't buy any wines we don't buy any grapes so everything what we produce comes from our vineyards okay. and the uh, our grapes and we are organic for, yeah for us it's also important because we are organic uh um, both both sellers are certified organic and um, the seller in greve was fine finally certified in 2017 and seller in uh, Marema was certified in 19 oh. but we have been always doing bef before the uh, mainly organic when making but then we switched to entirely organic and then we um, and received the certification and uh, uh, because for us being organic is a uh, uh, not only important, uh, not only important for the healthy product, uh, let's say, but also uh, it is important for the sustainability. Because when you use pesticides and herbicides for like 50 years on the same piece of land, then you cannot just use it anymore because the land oh. uh, is becoming exhausted and uh, over over it's like land land becoming dead and tired. So. Uh, so it's about preserving uh, preserving our precious piece of land for for future generations and right. for between the rows we are planting uh, seeds like fava beans, malt, barley, oats, mustard, 
and uh, when it, when they grow, when, when it, and, and a lot of others, but mainly those. And when they grow up, we mix them with the soil to give the soil more vitamins, more elements, more 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 everything. One soil without nothing. Uh, one soil without gr uh, grass, uh, without herbs, uh, without plants inside, don't give nothing number three. One soil with the plants, uh, with the grass, uh, take the elements when the grass dies. So the grapes at the end become more salty, more um, rich in flavor. More mineral. Yeah. More mineral. So um, again, Thank you very much for taking the time and thank you for, for the wonderful wines because we, all of my staff lo love your wines. It's a pleasure to hear that and uh, we wish you success on your project. Thank you again and, and I wish you all the best. Thank you. Thank you. Ciao, thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.